Hi everyone, it's me again, Dia, and you're watching House Plant Therapy PH. And today we are propagating photos. Uh, propagating photos is very easy to do. But before we get started, I'd like to take this time to thank everyone who subscribed to my channel. I'd also like to thank my family and friends for the support. And shout out to where are you? <laughs> a shout out to um, Jupi Ogis and his family. Also to Adolfo Lim for um, sharing most of my posts. Thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate it. All right, so let's get started. Propagating photos is very easy. So just grab your pony shears, scissors, or cutters, anything that you can use. When you choose a cutting, look for um, a healthy vine or healthy leaves. Don't cut it very near the tip of the vine, so probably we can leave four leaves there. Then let's cut it here. Um, there's not much space to the next node, so um, but preferably you can um, leave an inch or one inch and a half. already have a few cuttings here from my giant marble queen. I'm going to have a makeover video with my golden photos as well, so watch out for that. First, let's start with propagating photos using water. So just grab a clean jar and um, put water in it. And then what you do is just grab your cuttings and then just put them in there. You can um, change the water daily but for me personally I don't um, change it every day um, I just check the water if it's already dirty then uh, that's the time that I change the water okay and there that's how you do it and then just a few weeks just check it from time to time you already notice growth um, aside from water propagation you can also propagate um, photos using um, soil so I already have here a potted soil make sure that your soil is well draining to avoid um, root rot so using soil just grab your um, cuttings and then just stick it in there um, this is how it should look like like this so this part is uh, covered with soil and this part should be um, exposed to air like that so ang pugsok na din ha ng mga cuttings and actually I prefer propagating my photos directly through soil because I just leave it in there I don't have to like um, check musta na iyahang um, roots and then once uh, if, um, and if I notice yeah, enough now roots then I have to transfer it to um, a potted soil inside because if you let it root in water um, once you transfer it to soil then it just as well. so you have to make sure inside now the soil is always moist or damp around a transition from um, just pure water to soil will not be that abrupt. After a few weeks, um, you will notice growth sa yung cuttings. Uh, these cuttings are from my um, marble queen, not the giant one. This is the giant marble queen. So see if you can notice there's already um, root. There's a, there's a healthy root here and then new growth, new leaf. This one, a little, also here, there's new growth and new growth and my more roots. Actually, well, I share roots, <laughs> sorry. So now new leaves, each one new leaf, 
and then ang nodesra that's the one nga mo grow siya into longer roots like this one so if you put it directly in soil what you observe also a new growth just like this one there see and then new leaves new growth that's what you're going to see so I'll just leave it and let it grow so when you water um, just what I do is I just drizzle a little water in my cuttings and I place them somewhere they can get bright in direct sunlight. So make sure you lay sila kayo too close to the window, especially kung may go na dyan, um, uh, noon time, kayo mo, kung nagyapo ng init, ma, masunog sila. So, I um, already had a few cuttings ng ipag grow before. Ooh, this is my, from my golden photos. Um, tas tas na yung new vine. Um, Okay, I cut it sa balay because I, I, I really love um, both so they're very easy to take care of. Um, you can also use um, plastic water bottles or um, soft drink bottles so that you can recycle. So yeah, there you have it. Um, just to recap, when you want to propagate your photos, choose a healthy vine or um, a vine with healthy leaves and when you're ready um, put them in water or in soil place them somewhere they can get bright and direct sunlight and then just water them every day for water propagation change the water um, regularly um, it really depends on you um, for me regularly is when I when I notice that gamay na lang water or ugo na siya so that's the time that I replace or I change uh, the water because I'm also propagating another plant through water but for my photos I prefer propagating it um, through soil and for water day it would be best to use um, rain water because it does not contain any, any, any unwanted compounds like uh, tap water especially here in Cebu I'm sure a uh, tap water is um, chlorinated. So if you be if you be using tap water, um, try to um, let it sit for about 24 hours para masatol ang katong mga other things nga nabiha that the plant would not want and dili na siya absorb sa imo plant. So yeah, that's it. Hope you like the video and see ya.